Well, there's no question that the man in form is that uh, man running in lane five. Carsten Varhol from Norway could be their second gold of the day. Varhol is taken the Norwegian record down to 45.56. So let's introduce them to you. Here's Lucas Boer from Spain, second in the Spanish Championships, medalist in the Mediterranean Games outdoors. First and the best indoors, 46-23. Then we have the youngest in the field, or second youngest in fact, 19-year-old Fabrizio Saidi. We've got a relay silver medal in the European Juniors. In lane three, the national Here's Luca Janicic from Slovenia, twice a finalist in the European Championships outdoors, national record holder. And we have from the Netherlands, Tony van Diepen, just to 46-62. And now the world and European champion at the 400 hurdles. A mighty talent at a range of events, including this one, the 400. It's Carsten Varholm, former World Youth Octathlon champion. Now, on last year's form, he would be perhaps even the favourite. Oscar Husselos, the Spaniard, when he was disqualified after finishing a clear first across the line in the World Indoor Championships. This year, however, his best is 46.31 compared to the 45-69 he ran last year. Spanish champion. So two Spaniards, they go in lanes one and six. And then we have one from France, Slovenia, Netherlands, and Norway. Barholm, 45-56, and that's easily the best in the field. The uh, Slovenian, Janis. Janusik um, has a best this year of 46-1-3, and that's a long way behind Varholm's time. So this man is the very clear favourite. We've just seen the women's 400 metres, which turned out to be a very, very close affair. I wouldn't expect this one to be, at least for the gold. Or can Husselos recapture the sort of form he showed last year? Fine runner at 200 meters and 400 meters. On your mark. As Varholm is a 400 meter, 400 meter hurdle doubleist. No hurdles indoors, of course. So flat racing for Varholm. Quite happy to com come and compete at the European Indoor Championships. Some didn't do that. They're going to concentrate on the outdoor season. He reckons no problem in fitting in both. Bua, Saidi, Janicek. Van Tiepen, Varholm, Huselos. Set. Well, where they go, and the white there, and the Norwegian colours. We've seen current to success by Jakob Ingebrigtsen, and Varholm already eating up the stagger on Huselos and getting away from the rest of the field. Could be a parade for the Norwegian. He's coming across clearly into the lead. Huselos will follow into second place. And uh, it's 21.35 at the 200 metre point. It's quick and Varholm is stretching. Husserlos doing the best he can to hold him. Janusic is in uh, third place, followed by the Spaniards. Bua. But it's Varholm all the way around this track. He's led from the gun and Varholm comes up to his expected triumph in the 400 metres. He takes the gold medal. Who's the last get second? And the two men crashing to the track in close proximity in bidding for that bronze medal. The Dutchman Van Diepen and the uh, Slovenian Janicek. And Varholm has again smashed his Norwegian record. It's a world-leading performance. 45.05 because a very fine run by Husselos also in second place. So Varholm has uh, the European record has stood at 45.05 to Thomas Schoenleber from way back in 1988. And we've now got confirmation that Varholm has equaled that for this time of 45.05. Yet another triumph for this brilliant young Norwegian and this time it's 400 on the flat remember seeing him at the junior championships when he did the 400 under the Catholic in the in that same day 
Well, I thought it was going to be quick after that very, very fast first 200 metres, but 45.05, smashing the championship record, equaling the European record, which has stood all comers for a long, long time. That was a terrific race behind him as well, with Husilos and Van Dijkman both getting national records. Redemption to a certain degree for Oscar Husilos after being the first to cross the line at the World Indoor Championships last year. When he did actually, he was timed at under 45 seconds, only to be disqualified. Goes away with the silver this time. Yes, a tremendous improvement on what you've seen from him so far this year with that national record at 45.66. Let's just look again here, this triumph by Varholm. He's got a, what, two, three metre lead, and he stretches away, but Husselos really fighting hard. And look at the way Van Diepen comes up on the shoulder of the Slovenian, who's got a metre and a half at this point, but then they really come together almost at the finish, and both crash across it. But Varholm out front, equaling the European record. Then Husselos, and then these men bite, fighting for, for the bronze medal and crashing to the ground in so doing, but it's...